I think it's important to clarify that right from the beginning, the university was created with that notion, with that DNA that we had to be an innovative university. We wanted to be different from all the other universities around us. In many aspects, the University of Waterloo was a different university from all the other conventional universities. Our programs are more innovative. Our, uh, our, our research works are more innovative. The lessons for us is do not sit where you are. Defy the status quo, regardless of how good the status quo is. Always innovate for the better. Innovate in the classroom, innovate outside the classroom, innovate how you conduct your business, innovate how you define relationships, either national or international. I think this whole creation of amalgamation of all universities and institutions around one name, Sorbonne, is very innovative and very courageous to begin with. The world has a lot to learn from Sorbonne, the whole system, because it does really signify what a university, what, what an institution of higher learning is all about. You've done some marvelous things in the past, but Take them, use it as your momentum. Momentum will propel you further. So use the momentum of your history, of your culture, your past, but how, you know, use it to propel you for further. They are, they have the opportunity to be one of the leading universities in the world when they combine the two. Sorbonne University has a great opportunity to be different, different in a positive way. Because as I said, not many universities in the world will have the opportunity like Sorbonne Universities, you know, with plural has, because it is bringing a number of really, really good players together. I think Sorbonne will become, has an opportunity now, and it will transform itself into that leading university in the world, cares deeply about society, cares deeply about art and values, but is also so innovative, is at the cutting edge of technology, medical sciences, arts, humanities, the entire spectrum. So it has that potential. It has to mobilize this potential now in a very active way so that all those pieces can gel together, can come together. The, it's, the mathematical equation is phenomenal. This is what's so exciting about Sorbonne and what's happening in France. <laughs>